His life changed in less than a second. If I'd have ever taken the time to think what it would have felt like or what would have happened to my family if I was injured, I'd put a lot more thought into safety and making sure I never was injured rather than just going to work thinking it'll never happen to me. I'm always safe. A 12.5 still alive is life after 12,500 volts. And my presentation is my life before, during, and after my injury. The message that I present to the employees, to the staff, uh, to the companies comes from my heart. But it also comes with very graphic photos of the reality of an accident. Those photos and those images that I have are actual photos of surgeries that I had to go through and the after effects of those surgeries and they leave a lasting effect on somebody. I've had people talk to me and say, how did you live through that? I've had them listen to the stories I talk about my family and they said, I'm never going to take a shortcut again. I don't want my kids to have to go through what your children had to go through because of the mistakes that I had made. My mission here has been to share this message that an accident can happen to you. Uh, too many times we go through life and we hear stories about somebody else being injured, but we never put ourselves in their shoes. Uh, we never think about an accident actually happening to us because we never stop long enough to think about what it would be like if an accident happened to us. I'm not the same person I was 20 years ago. Physically, I only have 40% of the use of my legs. Um, I can only stand for short periods of time uh, due to pain. I can't walk at night because I can't see the ground I fall over. Emotionally, uh, I can't handle real stressful situations. You know, I wasn't able to play with my children. Anymore, I couldn't get on the floor and wrestle with my son anymore. I couldn't play sports with my kids. I couldn't take them snow skiing, water skiing, all these types of things. So those are things that I used to do with my kids that I've never been able to do since. This is more than about just them. It's about their family. It's about their friends, their coworkers. It's like a pebble in a pond. There's a ripple effect and it, and it touches everybody when an accident happens. The community that you live in, so the mission here is to stop people from having to suffer the amount of pain that I had to go through, from their families from having to go through this kind of pain, because it's a life-changing event that will change not only their life, but their family's life, their children, their parents, everybody. And this is what we want to stop. Nobody needs to have this kind of pain.